Hello guys, this is me Chris here, and today we're doing a little video on how to install Logmin Hamachi 2 for um, Ubuntu or any other kind of Linux distribution. This will work for any one, like I just said. Um, I'm going to be using this for Ubuntu because that's the one I have right now running. I have this running in a virtual box, but it still works fine. I'm going to move this aside so I can show you guys something. I have here, whoops, I'll make this over here. To show you something that I have right now, log in, log me in Hamachi right here. So I'm going to show you right now. I already did it before, but I'll show you how it works and how to log in and stuff. So what you want to do is right now download Hamachi by going to um Hamachi.com. I'll just go there for now. I have all these links will be in the description as well, so you don't have to get worried about finding these. As you see it says now in beta as Mac, OS X, and Linux. Just click on the screen here and I'll bring you to a page called Labs. And then scroll down and what we're gonna need is the um Linux beta. Now this command line is it everything runs by command. It's not like this there is no virtual box or a, or any um it, or any window. It's all by command line, which is pretty easy. It's really fine. It comes out with a um Read me, so it tells you a lot. Now it has one for 68, I mean 64-bit version is 32-bit version. Mine is 32-bit, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we're gonna get this file. Now I recommend you do not go into terminal and try to download this because it will not work. Trust me, I tried it before. Um, save this file. As you see, I already have it saved. Exit out of this. You can close this for now. And now we have logging in Hamachi number two. Now I'm gonna delete this because I already have one right there, which is right here. And we can just open this up and then have everything right there. So right now you see I'm still disconnected. I turned off the Hamachi tunneling service and logged out. Now to install it, you want to open up Logme in Hamachi. And I recommend you now is the time to open up a terminal. So what up applications terminal? Now what we need to do is we have to direct ourselves to this directory. Um, I recommend you do run this in root because I think this won't work unless you're in the root um, user. So we do um, cd root desktop and then the file name which is very long. I'll move this right here which is log me in hamachi 2.0.0 point one one dash x a six and if we're lucky nope I actually and there we are so now we're in this folder of x86 and now you see there is a couple of files here we're gonna do the install dot sh so we're gonna do um that install now if you're I think I learned this in Ubuntu if you're gonna go for a file you have to do dot forward slash and then the file name and there it says now it's installing the Hamachi service. It doesn't take that long. As you see, it's installed. Now it says, um, right now it just turned on back the telling service because I told it to turn off. So it started and now it's installed. Now it says to see the README to do next. It's, the README is kind of informal. I would read it, but I'm going to show you how to do it now. So what you want to do now is when you're in Hamachi, everything runs off the command Hamachi and then what to do. So right now we're actually going to log into Hamachi by doing Hamachi login. And I was going to say logging in and then once it's done it's going to say OK. Now as you can see after I just logged in, Tweakers Ubuntu just came online. So but let's say I actually want to, um, now to see a list of the commands you can do in the terminal just do Hamachi minus H. And that'll give you all of the commands. So let's say I'm going to leave the network. So I'm going to leave it right now. Hamachi leave tweak IRC. The tweak IRC thing is I'm creating a IRC server. That's why I'm using it right now. And now as you see, I just left the IRC server. Now let's say I want to join back the IRC server. And like I said, even it says it right here. Um, usage, Hamachi, and then the command. You can change your nick from here. So let's say I want to change my nick. It'll be Hamachi set nick, and I recommend you do that first because you, when you first join, your nick will be nothing. It'll just have a green dot right next to it. So I just put um, tweak 
Uh, Ubuntu. Oops, I spelled that wrong. Ubuntu. Now I just changed my nick. Whoops. Ah, uh, hold on. Oh, there it goes. If for some reason it wouldn't allow this um that thing right there. Now what we can do is we can now log into a network. I'm gonna create a new network right now for this purpose. This network ID will be um a bunch of video, and you guys can also join this if you want to. Thing is one, two, three. Actually, I might change the password just in case. Um, now we're gonna go here. As you can see, I made one called a bunch two video. And now to join this, if you scroll up, it says to join a network. Do here. Now you also can create networks. You can set the path. Everything is all just based on the command line. So now we're gonna do Hamachi join. Um, I recommend you do it. Just um, have cap sensitive on. So if something's caps, I recommend you to do it. Cap video one two three. And now we have just joined. And for some reason, my thing is tweak w tweak u. That's fine. So there you go, guys. That's how you install um, Ubuntu. I mean, log me in Hamashi on Ubuntu or any other Linux distribution. Um, it should work. What you want to do is for x86 is the same thing. Just get to x86.tgz. Now, I also said again, do not try to extract it or download it from terminal. It would not work. I tried it before. It does not work for me. If it works for you, you got luck, but it doesn't work for me. So I just, you should just download it take out the folder and just start everything of what I just did. So there you, there you go guys. Hope you guys liked the video. Please subscribe and comment. Hope you enjoyed.